What's next? Adam's apples. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's something at, you know, dudes have, right? All men have an Adam's apple. Usually, yeah, that's a safe, safe rule right. of thumb. So if I were to ask the crowd, that's probably, do we, who here has an Adam's apple? Well, yeah, the men. It, <laughs> yeah, uh, it's mostly the men. So technically, we all have this structure, the larynx, the cartilage in the larynx. It's just that in men, when we go through puberty, we tend to have testosterone levels go, go up, and that cartilage grows and expands. And it becomes more prominent. Oh, but so we women all do have, have Adam's apples. They're just not as large as gentlemen's. Right. We just don't tend to call it that when it's I did not know that. And not visible. We have like an Adam's baby apple, like a crab apple. We have an Adam's crab apple. Right. And <laughs> it, so the interesting thing there is inside of the Adam's apple are, are vocal cords right, right behind that in the right. larynx. And uh, w when you go through puberty and that grows, uh, the vocal cords tend to get longer and thicker, and men's voices tend to... Oh, that's when their voices drop. Drop. Now sure. yeah, I get it. So uh, I have here uh, a ukulele to illustrate that. So if you were to have a long... Uh... He lost me a ukulele. I right. don't know. If you were to have a big, uh, long vocal cord, it would make a deeper sound. And then right. if you had a short one... Oh, so women's voices are sound. naturally higher pitched because the cords are shorter. Yeah, basically. I gotcha. That's one well, of that makes sense. I get that.